Hey everyone, and welcome back to the Contemporary Resort. I'm taking the elevator down, escalator. Oh, it's not an elevator, it's an escalator. We're headed down right now to experience a dinner at a restaurant that you know I love. I've tried the bar several times, breakfast, but never the full dinner experience. It's time for Steakhouse 71. Disney's Contemporary Resort, let's do it. And here we are, we have made it for dinner. Let's check out that menu. They've got the French onion soup, which I have not only heard is great, but I, I think I've tried it before, if I remember correctly. Onion rings, the salads, bacon and eggs they have as an appetizer for dinner. That should be noted, because it's so good. So, important note, but we're here to try one of the incredible steaks that they have here at Steakhouse 71. I've heard good things, I am so excited to give it a try. Um, it's going to be great. Anything on the back? Nope, just Steakhouse 71. They also have a wine list here with lots of well, there's this non-alcoholic drinks. There's some specialty cocktails. So many options available. Now, some important things to note because we are here for the steaks. They've got a lot of different steak options still deciding. You do get to choose one side and one sauce when you get a steak. What we get, that's, I have no idea at this point, but they all look really good. I don't know. Maybe, uh, maybe the signature sauce you can also get the flight of sauces for an additional six dollars not a bad idea it all looks good though i haven't decided i gotta ask the server what we're gonna try so i think i am gonna go with the uh beef tenderloin medallions that was a recommended item from the server we've also got the wild mushroom sauce which is also recommended not 100 percent sure about that sauce but he recommended it so we're gonna go ahead and give it a try let's do it oh and probably also uh broccoli maybe asparagus he did mention the garlic mashed potatoes, but probably one of those two. And here they are, those medallions, the beef ones. They look super good. There's the mushroom sauce on the side. It does not look like a creamy sauce. I can't really tell. Broccolini looks delicious. Here is the flight. There is a flight of sauce right in front of us, and it looks so, so good. So we can try them all, and they're all listed on this little thing right here. Red wine, horseradish cream, lots of delicious ones for us to try. Looking forward to digging in, letting you know all about it. Let's do it. Now, while we're here, let's show others food. We've got the prime rib there. Maybe I'll try a little bite of that. That's a lot of food right there. We've also got the delicious, nutritious New York strip steak. Is it nutritious? I don't know, but I love. I know they're delicious. Let's give them all a try. Here we go. Okay, I have tried all three food items. All right, ready? My medallions, in my opinion, unbelievably amazing it's full of flavor tender medium rare is how i get it it is perfectly done with the mushroom sauce server was absolutely right incredible absolutely incredible it just it's hard to describe how good that flavor is now the sauces were all really good the pepper sauce is good mushroom sauce is good steakhouse 71 sauce is definitely sweeter mushroom goes perfectly with most of the steaks and the pepper sauce both of those are great the new york strip over here really really good Really good, a little tougher than this one, but still delicious. The uh, prime rib, which is actually uh, here for me, very tough, very, very tough. That's actually the one I would probably not recommend. I would go with the medallion or the New York strip. The uh, prime rib's a little too tough for my taste. Does come with the pudding though, which is nice. Overall, I'm blown away. I'm blown away by this steak, and I'm just about ready to say my favorite steak at Disney at the time of filming. Not messing around, that good. Gotta try it, go for Medallion or New York Strip. So good. Everything is so delicious. We've got an extra side here of mac and cheese. It's uh, one of the sides you can get with your meal. We got it in addition, let's try it. Steakhouse 71, you keep impressing me here. One of the best sides I've ever had, the mac and cheese with the, uh, with the, uh, the, the crumbs on top and the sauce out of this world. Out of this world amazing. Love it. The food was so good, we had to get even more. Yes, indeed. It's dessert time. That's the ambrosia right there. We'll see how it is with that sauce on the side. I don't have the menu in front of me anymore, but it sounded super good. But in addition, that's not the only... You think this is all the dessert? You are mistaken. We got the chocolate cake. The one, the only, the Steakhouse 71 Signature Gold Leafed Chocolate Cake. Let's dig in and try it together. Bon appetit. So the ambrosia cake, I thought was really good. Nice and fluffy, airy, little coconut flavor in there. The green circle on the outside is milk chocolate and it does taste good as raspberry there. The uh, Tower of Chocolate Cake. I actually thought it wasn't that great. I've had a lot better chocolate cake in the past. I would not go out of my way for this one. Let me tell you what I would go out of my way for. This restaurant in total. I cannot tell you how much I loved it, especially for dinner. You know, I love the burger 
And for dinner, that steak is out of this world. Incredible, amazing, highly recommended. Thanks so much, everybody. Really appreciate you sharing it with me, and we'll talk to you real soon. Until next time, have a magical day. See you, everybody.